Do y'all want to know why it was so important for them to force us to convert to Christianity? Not because they wanted to spread an enlightenment in the good word, but because they were very afraid of us. I'm pretty sure y'all heard of the Haitian Revolution. Oh, you know where black people fought against the French and won. They were so nervous, they even made laws. 1685, a law in Haiti prohibited the practice of African religions and forced slave owners to actually push their slaves to adapt the Christian faith within eight days now i really want to just ask this question y'all got knives bayonets swords pistols muskets rifles canyons bombs so here's the big question how did enslaved people with no upgraded weapons fight and beat against these people well this is cecile fatima and she was a haitian voodoo priestess and she did a voodoo ceremony to summon the strength to win against these colonizers. A week later, 18,000 plantations were destroyed and a thousand slaveholders got what they deserved. Now I can see why these colonizers want to demonize their practices. I mean, imagine seeing people like this, doing these ceremonies, converting their energy to fight against you. Very strongly put in the Bible, slaves be obedient to your human master with fear and tremble in the sincerity of heart as to Christ. There were instances of colonizers teeth falling out through battle, stomach pains, headaches, issues within the colonizer soldiers. I mean, look at this. The chief justice president judge lost his voice and had to adjourn court. Then the president of legislative council died. When court was resumed, the judge again lost his voice and he had difficulty speaking. The jury believed to have supernatural interventions. They do not like the personal, spiritual, and ancestral power that we were using to protect us. Voodoo means spirit. They had to erase our spirit, our strength, in order for us to be docile. Because what was done in Haiti shook the foundation of owning slaves. But you know, y'all stay dangerous.